Dash and Dot are quite robust. However, there are some best practices you should keep in mind when handling Dash and Dot. First of all, think about when you want to charge Dash and Dot. Remember, they run on a rechargeable battery. While you can't replace it, you can recharge it fully in less than 90 minutes, depending on the existing battery level. And when fully charged, the robots will last for two to three hours. Dash and Dot will tell you when they are running low on power. The power button starts cycling bright, then dim, and bright again, and you will get a notification within the app. Then, just connect the micro USB port at the end of the orange charging cord to the port found on the side of Dash and the back of Dot, right here. And then plug the USB end into a USB charger. You can't overcharge the robots, so feel free to leave Dash and Dot plugged in overnight. It's always a good idea to keep Dash and Dot clean, but do know that they don't like water or cleaning sprays. However, you can wipe them down with a cleaning wipe. Make sure you've unplugged the robot first, and then clean it with a soft, lint-free cloth. As I mentioned, Dash and Dot are quite durable and resilient, but they do like to be treated with tender loving care. And they are best buddies, so they really don't like to crash into each other. When you find yourself chasing Dash around, remember to pick it up and carry it from the bottom with two hands. Try not to hold Dash by the head, as the head motors may wear down more quickly. And you should use Dash on the floor when possible, since there is no height to fall from. And while Dot loves to be tossed around like a hot potato, try not to let Dot crash onto hard surfaces. Do take care with Dash's wheels. While Dash can move across mats, hardwood floors, and carpet, it likes smooth surfaces the best. Sometimes, carpet can create friction, which can slow Dash down and result in inaccurate distance traveled. It's always good to check the wheels at the end of your session to make sure nothing's stuck in them. And while Dash and Dot will turn off by themselves after being inactive for 15 minutes, don't forget to power them off when you are done by pressing the power button on the side here. Treat Dash and Dot kindly and they will become your new best friends.